The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers Should Taylor get admitted to a psychiatric facility? As a world-renowned psychiatrist, can Taylor Hayes not see her symptoms? She's getting a little overboard when it comes to her obsession with Rich Forrester. Just because she hasn't made a mannequin of Ridge and tried to kiss it doesn't mean she isn't completely nuts when it comes to her love life. She should know that this is very unhealthy and that she needs help, not for Ridge, not for her kids, not for anyone else, but for herself. So will she finally realize it and get herself admitted to a facility so that she is isolated and gets time for herself to find peace within? I say no, but I would definitely love to see that. Taylor has a lot of problems, one of which is anger management too, which if you ask me tells that she has never paid attention to her own mental health. Taylor needs therapy. Okay, so yes, just because Taylor is a professional doesn't mean she can cure herself. But if you've studied a subject for years and years and have been treating patients for decades, you can tell if you have some kind of symptoms. As a psychiatrist, Taylor doesn't know she's way too obsessed with Ridge in a very unhealthy amount. And until now, she hasn't been in a healthy relationship. It has to click to her someday that she needs help, she needs therapy, and she needs to love herself first. So what if she gets so mad that she ends up doing an extremely manipulative or violent thing that makes her realize how bad her behavior has gotten? Which is why maybe she decides to get herself admitted to a facility. Most of the time, people admitted there are highly at risk or suicidal, but as a doctor herself, what if Taylor just tries to isolate herself there, hoping to find a way for herself to accept her reality and not run away? Or at least what she can do is get herself therapy too. She needs someone to confide in and guide her right now, which means a therapist would be a great deal to help change Taylor's life. Of course, it's not real life, is it? But would you like it too if at least Taylor starts getting therapy and realizing that her obsession is only destructive? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to check some of our other videos. And we hope to see you again in the next video.